Hey friends, it's Teacher Izzy again. Today, instead of reading a book and doing a different kind of activity, we will be doing a mindfulness activity called Mind in a Jar. But before we start, I'm going to ring this singing bowl. It's a very different kind a vibration that you can feel in person but you will only be able to hear since you're watching me on video. So let's take three big deep breaths together and then we can start. one breath. I used to tell my students to smell flowers and then blow the candle. One more. Smell the flowers. Okay, I think I'm ready. So I went ahead and filled up a jar with a lot of water. So this is our mind. In a jar. Do you know where your mind is at? It's in here. We all have one. We just can't see it. I have a spoon to stir some of the items we're going to be dropping inside. One of them is rice. So the items that I'm dropping inside are going to resemble our thoughts. So I have rice, I have macaroni, Go ahead and start by dropping some um, white rice in there. This will symbolize some emotions that I have inside of my mind. And then this macaroni are some of my thoughts. And I'm going to stir it and ask myself how I feel in the mornings. How do you feel in the mornings? Sometimes I feel frustrated because I want more sleep and I can't get it. And there's other days where I feel very excited to start my day because I have a long day ahead of me. But nowadays, we may not be excited when we wake up because we're living the same day over and over. But that's okay. So let's keep stirring. You see that when we think and feel, this is what our brain can look like. When we feel angry, our brain can look like a blur. But when we take the time to breathe and become mindful of our breaths, our thoughts and emotions, they settle. Kind of like how the rice and macaroni are all the way at the bottom. And our thoughts and emotions can live in our mind like they're living in the jar. When we take the time to be mindful. And they won't cause so much stress and anxiety and they won't make us feel frustrated. So when we're in a rush and we're upset, like I mentioned earlier, it's hard to see clearly. It's hard to think clearly. But what can we do to help us calm down and think about what's going on? We can take some deep breaths. We can smell the flowers and blow the candles. And we can take the time to be mindful about our breaths. If we're walking, we can be mindful about the steps we're taking. When we're eating, we can be mindful about what we're eating. Let's be 
and just focusing on the now, on the present. Well, that is the end of our Mind in a Jar mindfulness activity. If you happen to get a jar with some rice and macaroni, you can continue this activity to become a sink or float activity. I have some chia seeds that I can also drop into this jar and we'll see if they sink or float. What do you think? Some are sinking and some are floating. You can't really see, but some are on the top and some are on the bottom and I can mix these as well. So they can float, they float. And even watching objects in water can be very peaceful and meditative. So when you need to cool down, this is a good cool down strategy for when you're at home. You need some time and space to breathe. So thanks again, friends. And I'll see you next time. Bye.